Married people, how do you initiate sex with your partner? Please remember to subscribe, thanks. We just ask each other tbh. We'll bring it up earlier in the day so we build up the anticipation with each other throughout the day, flirt with each other, gas each other up. All that. Then when it's finally time at the end of the day, we usually fall asleep cause we're so tired. But the cycle continues the next day. I make a bunch of overtly sexual comments towards her during the day. Then we put the kids to bed at 9 p.m., she goes to bed immediately after that, and I go masturbate in the basement. OMG, I've never laughed so fucking hard in my life. Then I realized this is my life 100%, then I cried, while I masturbated. I send her an Outlook calendar event and if she accepts, ITS on. It's business time. You know when I'm down to my socks it's time for business. Walk by him while taking my top off. He follows me wherever I go and it's been 30 years and counting. Yep. Show my husband my tits and we are off to the races. 99% of the time it works every time. The trick is to initiate sex during the day. We are both too tired at the end. Plus hanging out all day after is somehow more rewarding. Same goes for dates. Have sex at the beginning of the date, then go enjoy your time together without any pressure. Use my phone's torch to shine a shadow of my boner up against the bedroom wall. Kinda like a bat signal of sorts. As a lesbian the minute I figure out how to make this work for me and my gf it's fucking on. Unironically this is my favorite idea. If you use any toys that actually almost makes it better because you can set it up and leave it until she notices. I fan my feathers out into a big tall circle and crouch down, then hop really fast from side to side. Then I whistle real high and tilt my body back and forth. Then she lets me flap my way over to her and put it in her cloaca. I collect her a big pile of pebbles through the day if she likes them it's on. This penguin could teach some of us a thing or two. Turn off the lights and switch on the red lamp beside the bed. I have a Google routine called Sexy Time that dims the lights and gets music going. She hates it. By saying, you want to snuggle. She on the other hand just jumps on me and starts doing stuff. Edited to add, woke up to my comment blowing up with upvotes. Thanks everyone. Not sure why. We're middle-aged and been together over 20 years and our way of doing things just works for us. Just find what works for you. Everyone is different. Also, not sure of the Homer thing. Been told my attitude is more like Red Foreman's. OMG, wanna snuggle, is universal in our home for, let's have sexy time. A conversation from two nights ago. Me, wanna get naked? Husband, oh, I was about to go have ice cream. Yeah, I'll just have ice cream after. Me, K because it's getting late. Husband, I know, you must go to bed by 10. I'm positive the wife and I have had that same conversation. She needs to go to bed early on work nights, and I typically get the munchies before bed. If I don't hurry though, she'll be fast asleep. LOL. I walk around the house naked and knock things over with my boner till she takes the hint. I call it, the Godzilla. Okay there is a movie in my head and I am loving it. Fuck that present from Aunt Martha, it was ugly anyway and gathered too much dust. Godzilla. When I want some I whistle, when she wants some she come in the room and ask if I whistled. For spontaneous sex, adopt a parrot. Say, let me see your pee pee. Stand in front of whatever he's paying attention to and take my boobs out. Ask to spoon and then strategically back my ass up against him until he gets the hint. Plan it out earlier in the day like, hey can we maybe bone later if we feel up to it. Proudly announce when I've shaved above the knees. I used to yell, do you want to play hide the sausage? Now, after 48 years of marriage, we schedule it. Not as boring as it sounds, because we keep reminding each other, verbally and otherwise, of our next, date, it's harder, no pun intended, to be spontaneous when you're both 70. My grandfather passed four years ago now, and he and my grandma were never really, conventional, grandparents. They adored each other, had kids really young, and enjoyed the fact that we'd all come visit but not set up shop at their house. I remember visiting on some holiday as a teenager and we were all sitting at their dining room table and in that area. 
There was a lull in conversation and my aunt asked what the X notations on some days on their calendar that hung in the kitchen were. They were both in their mid to late seventies at the time. They looked at us, looked at each other, giggled, and initially said it was nothing. My aunt kind of prodded and asked, no really, what was it? My grandfather, in front of two of their children, spouses and grandchildren said, if you really want to know, it's when your mother and I play hide and seek, in the bedroom. We all laughed and were slightly grossed out, but as an adult now, shit. If you're having fun at 70, you keep having that fun. Do you, and your partner, and don't lose that spark. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe please.